Good morning, everybody. Dear Minister, Excellencies, Honorable Mayors, distinguished members of the media, ladies and gentlemen, dear friends, thank you so much uh, for coming here this morning. It's my very great pleasure to welcome you all to this inaugural edition of the New Cities Summit. Running a city is a very tough business. Uh, it is uh, full of relentless challenges, whether they're political or bureaucratic, uh, whether they're economic. It requires, I think, a very an entrepreneurial approach. India does not have, at this present time, a very good model for governing and managing cities. Good morning. Namaste. Ni hao. That's 80% of the world population, isn't it? How did we become urbanists 2,000 years ago, 3,000 years ago? But now we have to build a hundred cities of a million people and more. How are we going to do that? Do you think it is possible for anyone to help craft a sort of gold standard for the way cities are governed. Well, Barcelona has been trying to do this infrastructure hub, which is for me the right way to think about it. You're already investing in infrastructure. How do you connect the dots? When you have a monopoly, you are ob obliged to, to, to wise question of regulation because uh, you cannot count on the market uh, to make uh, a natural regulation. Do you put the right controls in place that allow people at any point to not use your service? I'm asking you in, as individuals, what do you see as the, the biggest challenges that us as the heroes are facing in our, in our journey in a digital city? We are here to discuss, debate, and you are here to question the panel, uh, as well as myself, on the very real question of where we are going, what is best practice, what works, what doesn't. Infrastructure has always been a very important part for cities and uh, even when we started to build cities 400 years ago. Today when we build cities and when cities are growing, is money a problem in all of this? Is, is money the real problem? That if you want to, as I do and the, the, the government of the UK does, want to transfer power from central government to cities, it doesn't just happen, it requires a real purpose. You need to create a minister to almost literally prize people's fingers off the levers of power and give them somewhere else. So that is my purpose. Korea was a poor fantastic. country 60 years ago. Korea was not uh, 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 at the fantastic. forefront. And yet the country itself, the policy, economic, mm. political, architectural, planning policies have led to a true improvement of living conditions. We spend a lot of money on innovation. Out of this budget, we will invest on six years 1 billion euro on research, universities, and innovation. Ce séminaire est, est important parce que c'est une occasion de contact entre le monde économique, le monde académique, les décideurs plutôt publics et le développement d'une ville, c'est tout ça en même temps. Our topic is hardware software and I think Depending on who you talk to, we're either on the cusp of a new age, the digital city, the connected city, the smart city. People are measuring themselves, and the point about the, the digital connectivity, they, they can compare what they have with what other people have in a way that wasn't even conceivable 20 years ago. People, no matter where they live uh, in the city of Atlanta, will be able to reach uh, the jobs and the opportunities that are set forth in the map. The world is moving towards uh, cars being less and less desirable. What should we be doing at the World Bank or at various NGOs? Well, it's wonderful that you're building this infrastructure or that you're investing in education or at a high level helping our government, but really I just need a job. 
I work inside the city. I've been there for a long time. I live there. I know what I have the political capital to get through the city council. One of the things that we found in our overall study of all of our cities is that 70% of cities have climate action or sustainability action plans. They already know what they want to do. Bicycle could become, um, in major cities all around the world, a major trend to basically navigate into the city in a better way. Les enjeux d'aujourd'hui et de demain, c'est l'intelligence, c'est la cohésion sociale, c'est l'innovation, c'est la culture. En fait, j'aurais pu n'employer qu'un seul mot, c'est la vie. Or, chacune et chacun d'entre vous, à sa manière, contribue à faire ce progrès de l'être humain dans la civilisation urbaine, puisque maintenant nous sommes une grande majorité d'êtres humains à vivre en ville. As many of you know, today as, as part of our program, we had um, the, the finalist present for our, our, our competition, which is called App My City. So the winner is um, uh, City Gardens. <laughs> recognize that this conversation needs more people at the party and so congratulations to the to the to the new city summit for bringing all of you to this table. Do you have the mechanism to get feedback from the stakeholders and the flexibility to be able to change these plans? I think this is the most important aspect of building a city and even maintaining a living city. Global problems, environmental challenges, questions of violence. It is in cities where these issues assume partnership and collaboration and how cities innovate and build on the basis of this capacity to move beyond the established systems and begin to create new tools, new processes, new forms of engagement. We, we recognized over the, the last few years that there are a number of areas of technology that actually make cities smarter. So we set up a, a program called Smart Cities to focus on a number of areas where we can bring something <laughs> to make things work better in cities. The concept of a public-private partnership is, a, is essential in the relationship between the, the private sector and the municipalities and the big, the big cities. Devons-nous régler le problème de la mobilité globale par un transport en commun à développer? Mais nous sommes confrontés à un vrai problème de crédit. So partnerships are very, are desperately needed, new kinds of partnerships. We hope to stay in touch with all of you in the coming year. Hope to see you next year at the next summit and uh, on to the future. We have entered the first century of cities. And so cities matter now more than ever. And that to solve the issues uh, of cities and of the boom of urbanization globally, we really needed new thinking, new ideas, innovation, but above all, new partnerships partnerships particularly between the public sector, the private sector, and the research community. Things happen in cities. That's where economies are most vibrant, that's where creation takes place, uh, that's where social problems are largely. Um, and as we move towards an increasingly urban planet, we have to um, get cities right. We have to make them places that people really want to be and that are thriving and dynamic, etc. This is what we're trying to do.